Hello, Gemini. It's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot, and I'm coming to do your weekly reading for the week of July 10th through July 17th, 2017. The cards I'm using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. Um, I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, and subscribing and setting up personal readings. And if you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me. We can set something up. Um, I don't know if I said this, but make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. And don't forget to subscribe. Okay. Other than that, let's get this show on the road. Ooh. So, some of you are letting go of a third party in hopes of a better future. Great idea. All right. Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. July. July, July, July 10th through 17th, 2017. Wow, my heart just felt like real warm. Like how you feel when... You go on vacation and come home and see your dogs if you got pets or just something that you really care about. All right, so something going on. At, I mean, this could be a work situation or this could be like a power struggle here. All right. Okay. Mm-mm-mm. Okay, so... There's a power struggle going on, and there's something up with a secret about somebody's masculinity. I don't know. I just got like a flash that somebody's girlfriend wants to be a want a sex change. Okay, just a little flash. I'm not sure if that's the whole thing. But I'm going to ask, what is this secret? What is this secret? What is this secret for the Gemini? What is this secret for the Gemini? The weekend of July 17th. July 10th through the 17th, 2017. Mm. Alright, so the secret is about somebody invading somebody's personal space and boundaries and disrespecting. So somebody... I feel like it's using their job to disrespect somebody or using their power to disrespect somebody. Alright, let's keep going. Let's see what's going to happen here. Alright, what is this masculine divine about? What is this masculine divine about for the Gemini? Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. Alright. Mm. All right, so this masculine divine is about somebody, an arrogant person who just keep coming back and forth. So the masculine part in this situation just keep going in and out. I still want to know this secret. I feel like it's something more to this secret. What is this secret about? What is this secret about? Gemini, Gemini, July 10th through 17th, 2017. Okay, we'll take this one. All right, let's just see what... Presence, freedom. All right, somebody offering to help. Wow, I don't know. I feel I don't know why I'm feeling like sex change. Somebody trying to offer to help somebody pay for a gift, or just saying they're gonna pay for it, and it's gonna lead to a breakup because this person really feel like that you're using them for money, but you're being honest and you want this person to open your heart to them. So. I don't know what what's going on here. I have no idea, but I don't know. I feel like this might be a same-sex relationship. I feel like somebody secretly want to go because of they feel like they're getting their space violated. And then the feelings of being more masculine is just like on and off in and out in and out in and out like it's not like a set thing it's like okay i want it okay i don't okay i want it I, okay i don't and then here power wave 
Yeah, somebody just feel weak because they feel like they can't make the decision. You know, that's nothing to feel weak about. You, you're doing something that's going to change your whole life. Your partner... I feel like you get mad at your partner. I don't know if this is you or your partner, but you guys are mad at each other. Your partner's mad at you because, you know, you keep getting mad at them because you don't know exactly what you want to do, you know? Mm, okay, more secrets, but it's going to be revealed by the end of... I already know what that is. All right, so I feel like the secrets is going to be about your friends talking sideways about you when you're not around, you know. Yeah, they talking about how you're like undecisive, but this is a big thing. They don't understand. Like everybody's uh, way of getting there is different. All right. Ooh. So I feel like in the end, you're going to end up letting go of your friends. Or you already let go of your friends because of this. But if you don't want your partner to leave you, you need to be more understanding of your situation. To Yeah, you need to look at yourself. Look at what you're doing to this person, you know? You know, they're trying to protect you. They're not trying to, like, be buttholes do you. They're trying to protect you and give you a chance to know what you really want. So just take your time. You don't have a time limit. There's no time limit with stuff like that. You do it when you're ready. Alright, alright, alright. So I'm clearly going to miss a lot of people with this. But this is the message that's supposed to go out. And this is the message that I'm putting out there, okay? So for everybody else, sorry. Better luck next week. Alright. Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. What's going on for the Gemini for the week of July 11th through July, July 10th through July 17th, 2017. All right. So secrets. Okay, so maybe some secrets are going to come out today is the 11th. Yeah. All right. Jeez, what is this? Gemini, you messing up my cards. All right, ooh. So somebody about to come out of feeling backstabbed. They about to get some back um, news in the mail, but they're gonna get the money that they want. So I feel like somebody might have put up a loan or something to get this procedure and I feel like it was a, either a denial letter first I don't know. You're going to end up coming up with the money somehow. Like somebody said they wasn't going to give it to you. Or you didn't get it from this place and you got it from another one. All right, but let's get this going. Gemini. Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. July 10th through 17th, 2017. All right. All right. This doesn't make you weak. Does not. Mm. I don't know, this sort of makes me feel like you might end up separating from your partner, but I don't, if you're not separated, but I don't feel like it's going to be a long thing. All right, so Seven of Swords, Seven of Swords, and that's reversed. Result product of your labor, wisdom, and outside support. Yeah. Okay, let's keep going because that could mean anything right now because you got negativity coming from your friends. Oh, yeah. I mean, just the you got to stop talking to people about what you want to do. That's why you're so confused because you're thinking about what Alex and Amanda want you to do and what John over there said what you should do. And, and you know, you're not thinking about what you want. So you need to think about what you want. So got the King of Coins. King of Coins says, a person of trust will guide and help you is approaching. Approach any task with great planning and organization. Yeah, so basically just make sure you want it. 
get all your stuff together, the reasons why, and whatever, money, and just do what you do whenever you feel like doing it. You can reschedule. You might not get your deposit back, but you can reschedule. All right, so we got the two of staffs reverse. Surprise, unexpected outcome, and fear, fearful anticipation. So that I think that's just what you're scared of. You're like, what if it don't go right? You're thinking about all the wrongs and not the rights. You know, when you want to do stuff, I mean, we only live once. Just do it. If, if it's what you want, it's what you want. Don't think about all the negative about stuff. All right, uncertainty and depression and doubt. Okay, so you'll get over all this once you stop listening to everybody and do what you feel like you need to do and when you just make your choice. That's the first thing you need to do is make a choice. All right, but that's all I have for you guys. Make sure you... Let's see what's at the bottom of here. Oh, yeah. So... I don't know. You got people trying to hold you back and people trying to protect you. But make sure to check your sun, money, rising signs. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Um, don't forget to subscribe. And you have a wonderful week. Make a choice.